Hi kitties, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Um, let me introduce myself for all the new subscribers. Uh, my name is Quinta, I am 28 years old and I'm a full-time college student um, working on an engineer degree. I live on benefits of the government, well it's a, more of a loan and I'm trying to um, stay or get debt free um, with the cable budget method and the cash envelope method um, and I hope by combining these two uh, these two methods I can pay off my loans and bills for this year build up some wealth for next year and um, make sure that I get into the habit of making a good financial choices for the future for um, well my potential family and for all the people that uh, came back and support me hi thank you so much for coming back and um, thank you so much for commenting in the in the comment section I really enjoy having conversations with you guys and watching your videos and um, so I want to say thank you for that Today we're gonna start a new uh, month, so this is a budget with me video. Um, I think I figured out how I want to do my monthly overview. Um, so without further ado, let's get started. <laughs> So if you're new to my channel and you don't know the Kikego uh, budget method, it's a Japanese method of budgeting um, and tracking your finances. I will uh, link uh, my starting video uh, in the top so I can get a, I will, I'm uh, going a little more in depth in that video. Um, but basically it's the same as any other um, any other budget where you take your income um, and you subtract your expenses um, and then uh, you subtract how much you're saving for the month um, and then what's left is the spending of your month because I am only paid monthly I uh, thought this was the best way for me to do my budget and um, I'm just trying to figure out how I can make this work for me and um, by using like paper and pen I actually have to go through my receipts and my bank statements every day every day at the end of the day and I just write down all the expenses that I made um, this is to track how much I spend every week and um, at the bottom there's always a little reflection portion of um, how you did for the month um, by reaching your goal is always did you go over your spending budget or did you go uh, or did you have leftover so that's basically always the goal did you did you go over your spending or not um, and then how can I improve if I did go over um, and uh, to make this a little um, easy at the end you um, set like a little reward for yourself that if you if you have some savings that um, you give that money a purpose and a goal so you don't just um, spend it on frivolous things instead of um, using it for something that you actually need um, so what I do every budget with me is I calculate my income, my expenses and savings and I pick a goal or a, um, a reward um, and then during every weekly Wednesday check-in I fill in every week. Um, so 
first of all, I know what I want my reward to be, um, which is my emergency fund, because I set some new goals on my Instagram, and one of them is getting serious about an emergency fund. Um, emergency fund. Because uh, now that I paid off some loans, I can put more money towards my emergency fund. So that's what I want to do. Um, if I have any leftovers of my spending and um, I decided that I want my month to go with um, let's put my monthly breakdown to the side there you go um, but um, this is for example the, this week I'm filming this on Sunday, so this is still this week. Um, and every red heart is uh, a payday. So what I want to do is make, instead of my um, monthly spendings on the calendar month, I will use every um, I will use every pay month. So when I get paid, this will be the end of the month of August, and then this week over here will be um, for in September because this is a week that I will use these actual funds um, as a little update for the people that have been here longer and uh, kind of know that I've been struggling with um, getting these. It's raining outside, so I don't know if you're hearing that, but if it's a uh, if it's a nice background ambiance, all the better. But um, yeah, so let's uh, calculate my income and my expenses and how much I will be saving for this month. Well, trying to save. So let's have my pen and pal over here. Here we go. So for this month, as an income, we do have um, my full income and then uh, 50 euros of groceries that my boyfriend uh, sends me at the beginning of every month, so the first. So that means that we have one, three, five, one with the additional 50, um, which means I have an income of 1401. And for my monthly expenses, I do have to pay my uh, water bill this month. So that means that this will all be in my expenses. So that means we have nine, 962 euros. And then we add my debt. My debt numbers, which are 38.50 and 24.49 and 43, which means for my expenses I have um, 1,025 euros. So 1025 and then we add my groceries. I'm sorry if I'm talking a little loud, but I'm trying to uh, talk louder than the rain. <laughs> but um, yeah, if we have the um, 1000 euros and 25, 1025 for my bills and then 130 for my groceries, we will end up with uh, 11, 55 so that's a weird number because I usually have like 1200 something but because I paid off a loan I don't have to uh, pay an additional 100 euros so this is a weird number for me but let's see one one five five 
And then for my spending, I always um, I always have 40 euros. So that's 10 euros for every month. So if we have 1401 minus 15, uh, 1155 and minus the 40 euros, I will have 206 euros left. I will put the six euros in my buffer because it's kind of low and then um, I will save 200 euros for my sinking funds and uh, yeah my sinking fund um, so that's something we don't need anymore um, I'm gonna pause the video for a second because it's raining abnormally hard and um, I will be right back. A few moments later. Hey guys, I'm back. Um, it started to rain a little, a little softer, because uh, I didn't want to scream at you guys, so uh, I just decided to stop the video for a little bit. Um, but yeah, this is my monthly overview of um, well, my my budget with me. Um, we do have to make a different uh, monthly overview for the month of October because um, I figured out that my uh, financial help for my um, yeah my student financial help is going to be lower, um, so we have to make a whole. Uh, new monthly breakdown but that's fine we will do that in the next video or in the next um, budget with me um, and for now I have a little surprise stuffing cash stuffing because it's Sunday and for next week I do have to have my grocery money so um, here's my grocery shop envelope we have 10 euros left and we're gonna take that out so we're gonna put that to the side for a little bit and um, I give myself 30 euros every week uh, for my groceries so we're gonna grab my new grocery envelope oh there's a little glare oh no wait can we yes there we go so I'm gonna put my new envelope to use. I like to have a minimalistic uh, minimalistic theme in my uh, in my videos. So that's why uh, there's not a lot of embezzlements, um, um, embellishments, or anything. Just a chalk, just a chalk pencil that I can erase with water. Um, so that's. 30 euros in my grocery money. Um, let's put that over here. And then this 10 euros will go into my emergency fund, which also has a new envelope. So we're gonna take out my emergency fund old envelope, take out the tracker, and that means that I have 10, 20, 30 euros in my emergency fund which is great. I'm trying to get at least, um, I think I can get to 150. I'm not trying to um, get to exaggerated with uh, my goals for my, my emergency fund when it comes to uh, the end of the year, because I get paid monthly. Um, I can't put down like uh, 10 or 20 euros every week so I have to uh, try and save as much as I can with the bills that I have but for now at least I'm using my new envelopes and I'm really excited to have these because they just look a little prettier than my old ones so um, 
I want to say thank you so much for watching my video because it's going to rain again. <laughs> this is not the day for filming. Um, but yeah, um, thank you so much for watching my video. Um, if you like the video, please like uh, the video for the algorithm. It really helps my channel. We're almost at 50 subscribers, so thank you so much for that. And um, I hope you have a better better day than I have because this is just gloomy and I'm just gonna stay inside and clean watch you guys' videos catch up and um, yeah I will see you next time thank you so much for watching bye